succulent growers, it's Lynn. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing an update on the Hoya Kerry that I got as a single leaf cutting quite a few years ago now and how it looks like today. And what a perfect day to do an update on the Hoya Kerry, commonly known as the sweetheart plant, on Valentine's Day. And uh, this is the gorgeous Hoya Kerry plant I've got here. And this is one that I got a few years ago as a single leaf Hoya. And those of you who know that I have been watching my channel for a long time will know that I made a video at the time and I actually called the video the Hoya Kerry single leaf con. Because a lot of these single leafed Hoya Kerries are actually just sold as a single leaf. And it's a bit hit and miss if they're going to survive long term, which I talk a little bit about about that video and I've made updates about this. And that's because with these Hoya Kerries, a lot of the time they just cut the leaves off, put them into soil, and then they just don't live long term because they don't have any nodes. So, you know, they can't carry on growing. They need a node to root and grow. Some of the Hoya Kerries have been, have been potted up, planted up with the nodes. And I got two of these Hoya Kerries at the time. The one just completely died. And when I got it out, it was just a leaf stuck in soil. And this one had roots and it had a node. And that's why it went on to grow into a gorgeous little plant. And uh, this is what it looks like today. I think I made an update on this about a few few months ago and it's, it's just looking remarkable beautiful beautiful plant and if you didn't see the very original video I did a few years ago on the single Hoya Kerry leaf the, the, Kerry, the Hoya Kerry single leaf Valentine's Day con do check that out because as I mentioned sadly a lot of the single leaves are sold just as a gimmick around the Valentine's Day people think they look lovely buy them and a few few weeks a few months later they just die because they, they don't have a node attached and therefore they're not able to root very lucky with this one it's absolutely gorgeous and uh, that's a bit of an update on that so do check that original video out and uh, also check the other updates I've done I'll put the videos down below in the video description as well as up above and I have also made a complete video on how to care for the Hoya Kerry Valentine's plant the sweetheart plant so also check that out should you have one of these Hoya Kerries and you also want to know how to care for it and if you do have a single leaf or you're given a single leaf for Valentine's don't give up on it sometimes as I mentioned it's hit and miss if they're going to grow you can even remove it from the pot and check if it's got roots or, or and it's got a node attached or you could just leave it and put it into a, a bright position and see how it grows because I was very lucky with this one it's actually got a bit of sort of variegation on the leaves absolutely gorgeous so that's an update on that one I'm going to show you a couple of my other ones now this one here is a gorgeous variegated Hoya Kerry and this was given to me by my, my wonderful friend Kath at Purple and Thorns here on YouTube and it's absolutely gorgeous. She gave me as a little plant and uh, Kath if you're watching this this is what it looks like now gorgeous variegated Hoya Kerry very beautiful and they have these these succulent sort of stems that they it's like a climbing succulent where it grows all these along and that this is how they anchor themselves on this is my very large Hoya Kerry growing all along the window we have it sort of tied up there so it's going up to the top to support it absolutely beautiful Hoya Kerry this is one I got as a mature plant quite a few years ago from a cactus and succulent nursery Cacteen Harg a uh, very beautiful plant and uh, it produces beautiful little flowers every year they're, they're only little small flowers on the, the Hoya Kerry but lovely bundles of blooms and it's absolutely gorgeous I love it so that's a very mature one I'll just show you there where it comes from beautiful and then I have this gorgeous variegated one and then very happy this is sort of extra special in a way because it was one I did grow I did have from a leaf that did really well so do check out the original video as I mentioned you'll see what a transformation it is and uh, let me know if you've been growing one of these or you had a Hoyas Kerry single leaf either this time for Valentine's Day or in the past or you bought one for yourself and how did it do for you as I say don't give up on them too too soon because they're not all they're not all a con sometimes they do take it all depends if they have the node attached and uh, I just want to mention, I'm not really into all these special days like Valentine's Day and all that. But, um, you know, 
I always think that the most important thing when it comes to Valentine's Day, a lot of people say, oh, I don't celebrate it because I don't have anyone special in my life and all this. I'm very blessed to have a wonderful, wonderful partner, Hans. He's, he's an absolute angel. So I'm incredibly lucky. But I just want to mention to, to all of you, you, the most important person to love is yourself. Not You can't... You can't rely on other people to make you happy. You have to love yourself. It took me a long time to learn that. <laughs> so I'm getting emotional, but because it's something that's been very close to me, it took me a very long time. And I'm sure, I know that there's many people watching this video that probably feel in that way as well, either in the past or they are now. Learn to love yourself because you are the most important person in your life. Nobody else. Remember that. So thank you so much for watching everyone and all your support and yes I love all of you and I can't thank you enough and for lots more tips and tricks please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give that notification bell a click so you can be notified when up no, upload, upload new videos and uh, also please give this video a like. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter and Facebook at Desert Plants of Avalon. And for more growing tips as well as regular articles on caring for different types of cacti and succulents, do check my website out, desertplantsofavalon.com. I want to wish you all a fantastic, loved up, plant powered day. And remember what I said, love yourself.